are you all today? My name is Mackenzie and I'm so, so happy that you're here. So today I wanted to bring to you a video all about what's in my wallet as a minimalist because I really try my best to keep my wallet as minimal as possible um, because it's very small, but also um, I feel like it's, it's so nice to just kind of declutter your wallet because it's something that you carry with you everywhere and if you're trying to pay for things or if it, you're trying to flip through everything in your wallet it can be kind of stressful so it's nice to just streamline everything and make it all very minimal and also with intention as well so without further ado let's go ahead and get started okay you guys so this is my wallet um it's a little bit rough around the edges but i kind of like that about it um i got this in india uh for about 40 rubies so i really love it it has some really good memories attached to it and i just love like the design i love like this red color and then this little uh trim here and then you got like the little bamboo or whatever this is um i'm not exactly sure but um i bought this second hand and second hand can be awesome especially when it's from a really amazing spiritual place i feel like i carry it with me everywhere um my lessons that i learned there so okay anyway sorry for the long spiel but I'm going to go ahead and show you guys. Um, this is kind of like what I have in there right now. Uh, this is it. So I'm going to show you guys. I have a couple of compartments here. And then also this middle part is where I keep... Um, I keep all my coins and stuff. So basically, in this pocket here, I just keep my health insurance card, some cash, and then a couple of cards. So I'll, and then my driver's license. So I only have, I keep in here, um, right now there's four cards in there, but one of them is an emergency card because it has a little bit more money on there. So in case something does happen, um, I like to keep that in my wallet as well. But, and then I always like to carry a little bit of cash with me uh, just in case there's like a tip or parking or something like that with where I'm at. And then of course, health insurance is really important in case something happens. And then in here, so then this is like my little compartment where I keep coins. I don't really have any in there just cause I really, I really don't pay with cash that often. I usually just use my card. Um, and then you also will notice that I don't keep any receipts. So I don't keep receipts. Um, maybe that's not smart, but but if all they do is they just kind of clutter it up. And if you do want to keep your receipts, it's good at the end of the day to take out your receipts and uh, flip through them, see if you need them or if you want to archive them or keep it, put it in your budget, whatever it is that you want to do with receipts. But keeping them in your wallet um, really just kind of just makes it really bulky basically. So, and then I have my other cards in here. So basically these are just any business cards that I picked up. Um, that's my Colorado, if I'm in Colorado, uh, my King Supers card. <laughs> Actually, I probably should just get rid of that. And then in Starbucks, I also have some uh, other business cards in here and then also some special cards. So I picked this up uh, when I was in uh, San Francisco. There was like a really nice store. I also keep this. This was the psychic that I went to in Sedona. And I also keep my guru in here. I have a little picture of her and every time I'm flipping through it, I love seeing this photo. I love it. And she just, oh, like she just looks so happy. I love that photo. So basically, yeah, I keep any uh, gift cards or anything that I got just in case I'm out, Starbucks, stuff like that, but that's it. So I could actually probably streamline this a little bit more and get rid of a lot of these cards, but I do like to keep, you know, some of my more spiritual cards in here. So when I'm flipping through, I can be like, oh, look at that. Like I love having Alma in here. I feel like she's traveling with me everywhere. And so yeah, so basically that's it. So I do want to give you guys a couple of tips as far as keeping your wallet. One was the receipts thing. Receipts are so bulky, so don't keep receipts in your wallet. Two, just go through and if you don't have any cards that you don't actually use, um, like I could probably get rid of my one card that's just kind of an emergency card, but I do like to keep it with me. Um, otherwise, I just have my debit card and my credit card. Um, debit card, uh, in case there is something, like if I go get gas, the cheaper gas is with the debit card, but then I put everything else on my credit card because then I earn points. So that's kind of how I do it. And then of course, health insurance. And then for these, it's just if I'm out and about, 
Uh, if I want to go say like if I'm at the mall and I have like a Forever 21 gift card, I will go to Forever 21 and I can pick something up. But uh, the reason I've had these forever in here and I think it's just because I'm just not a big shopper. So, but you know, I just keep them in here just in case. And then same with the other cards. Um, I just like to keep them in here. And then I think too, having a smaller wallet really helps because you know, you don't have as much space in here. So with this, I mean, I don't know if you guys can tell, like it's pretty small, like it's, it's, yeah, it's about the size of like my hand. So uh, I don't have a lot of space in here and then if it gets too bulky, I can't even close it. Like it just won't close on me. So I then I know that I need to start clearing out my wallet and it's a process, like you have to do it often. So, um, so yeah, so anyways, that's kind of my wallet here. I'm really, really excited to show you guys. Uh, if you guys have any tips or anything on how you keep your wallet very streamlined and very minimalist, please put them in the comments below. But anyways, I love you all so much, and I will see you on my next video. Bye!